you're going to get a better pump when you have a waffle and syrup Oreo prior to your workout. So everyone, everyone has to have one. Has everyone had one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, we did. Oreo I forgot. Oh, we went ham. Yeah, we did. Remember, Anthony was chucking them across the Yeah, that. Just. A little pre workout action? A little pre workout action. Oh, my body's like. And, and, come on, man. You're okay. getting soft right now. This is, yeah. This is, yeah. This is mm -hmm. what? Yes. Yeah, Everything to me if I do. Today I'm just like running some errands. I'm gonna ship out something that I sold on Poshmark and I am applying for jobs. I got my resumes printed out so um, I'm just going around to a few restaurants like right by my house um, to just apply for a waitressing job. So that's kind of the plan for today. Um, I've been getting these drinks from Starbucks. It's the Passion Tango iced tea, not with lemonade or anything just the iced tea unsweetened so that's zero calories and then I just add um, I asked for like a little bit of coconut milk so basically the only calories come from the coconut milk but I don't usually even track it so yeah anyways that's what I'm doing for today um, and I don't think anything else interesting is happening so that's it for now and I'll see you guys in the next clip all right guys, so I'm gonna get a little bit creative today and make like a protein dessert type of thing. Um, I bought the Flexible Dieting Lifestyle um, on Instagram. I bought his ebook like a while back, but I've never made anything from it. So this recipe looks really simple. I'm not gonna be able to make them into peanut butter cups though because I don't have that like mold uh, like shape 
thing for the cup so I might just make them into like bites so we'll see how it goes um i'm gonna just like follow this as like an example or like a model but I'm, i don't think i'm gonna follow it like exact because i'm gonna be using quest protein um i actually am out of level one from first form i have four tubs of formula one but i have no level one and formula one is like the post workout like really quick digesting so it just doesn't work as well for baking or cooking i've found like level one is the one that you want to use when you're making recipes and stuff like that so um i just ran to like vitamin shop and got like the one serving of quest protein like comes in a little packet of one serving so i'm gonna use that yeah we'll see how it goes i've never made them so i'm hoping they come out good but um it's like no baking or anything you just like pop them in the freezer when you're done so hopefully they are good and i'll share the recipe with you guys that i use and i'll also show you how i track them like how I break it down to know what each bite will be so I'll show you guys all of that um, and hopefully you guys enjoy this and I'll see you in the next clip all right so the ingredients we're gonna use are protein um, I'm using this quest cookies and cream um, you need well you need cream cheese I have reduced fat just so there's less fat um, some stevia I'm just gonna use a trivia packet and it calls for optional sprinkles so i have some sprinkles honestly i don't know if i'm going to use the sprinkles because they're kind of just like useless carbs and then um he has reduced fat oreos but all i have is firework and waffles and syrup in here so i'm just going to be using like regular oreos but if you want like the best macros try to find the reduced fats um but yeah so that's it okay so his recipe calls for eight grams of protein this packet has 32 so i'm just gonna multiply everything by four and just make the whole packet okay so since the recipe is basically i'm just doing like four times what the recipe is um it called for half of an ounce of cream cheese so i'm going to be doing two ounces of cream cheese all right so i also ended up adding half a cup of this um just plain greek yogurt just to make it a little bit more like cheesecakey like frosting ish so now i'm just mixing everything together so it's starting to get nice and thick everything's mixed i just got a plate and put some tin foil on it um this is gonna go in the freezer i'm gonna put a little canola spray Okay, so now I'm just going to figure out how many bites it will make. Maybe like four to six. So once I figure out how many it makes, I can track all the ingredients and then just divide by four or six or however many um, this makes to figure out how much would be in each one. So I'm just going to split it up into however many and we'll go from there. Okay, so now I'm gonna crush the Oreo, but I'm gonna take just the cookie part and throw out the frosting and just crumble up the outsides. Which is so sad. So now I'm just going to put them in the freezer for, it says one to two hours, so we'll see. Okay, so bear with me while I'm tracking this because it's going to be hard for uh, you guys to like, watch what I'm doing, but I'm going to try my best here. So I go to add food, and then you're going to hit meals and create a meal, and now, so we'll name it cheesecake protein bites so now we're going to add items to this meal we're going to find the quest protein the protein add and we're going to do this cream cheese scan it we did 
two ounces. Add again the yogurt. Now I did half of a serving, so we'll go to half. Add. And then for the Oreos, I just took the cookies, and I know it's going to be in here, so I'm just going to do Oreo cookie, no icing. The first thing, cookie only, no cream. So it's only two, it's two pieces, which is exactly what I used. I just used one cookie, so add that. And then I'll just do the sprinkles. We'll do one serving. That's what it's looking like, so we're going to save this meal. And now, say you want to add it into your tracker for the day. Go to add food, hit meals. There it is. And then for the serving, since we got five out of them, it's um, going to be... You're going to have to go to the decimal one because they don't have like a one-fifth fraction. So just do that and do 0 0.20. And for... One of them is going to be 71 calories, 2.7 fat, 4.6 carb, and 7.5 protein. So it's really good. I'll probably eat like two or three at a time, honestly. So um, I'll let you guys know once I try them how they taste, but that is how you make them and how I tracked it. So hopefully you guys found that helpful. All right, so while I wait for those to harden, I'm just going to make some lunch. I'm going to have four ounces of grilled chicken, about 100 grams of cauliflower mash, and then probably about 100 grams of zucchini as well, so I'll show you guys that. And I did find a better cauliflower mash brand, so I'll show you guys that. I know I um, showed you the one I bought in the last video, but I actually found one that has some better macros, so I'll show you guys the new one that I'm using that I showed you guys in my last video. It is 80 calories, four and a half fat, eight carb, and three protein. I found this one instead. Um, it's not seasoned, so like I just put my own garlic powder on it, but the macros for this are 50 calories, 3 fat, 6 carb, and 2 protein. So they're a little bit better. Yeah. Yeah, because this is the best lighting. All right, so we're gonna try the bites now. Mm. Oh, yeah. I have a special guess. Okay. Very interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Focus. Focus on me. Huh? It's pretty good though. You can really taste like the yogurt. Yeah. Well, maybe I have to do a different flavor. Maybe if I'm in peanut butter, protein, I might do that. I don't know, it definitely tastes like cheesecake though. Is it supposed to? Yeah, like oh, cheesecake okay. bites. And like I use cookies and cream um, protein because like the What's macros Oreos. Should I eat the whole thing? Yeah. All right, so the macros for one, 2.7 fat, 4.6 carbs, 7.5 protein, 71 calories. Oh, it's not. Oh, there we go. So the verdict. Delicious. Yeah, I'm gonna make these again. I think I'm gonna use uh, like a better flavor of protein, so it has more like actual flavor to it. Cause you definitely taste a lot of like the yogurt and cream cheese. Mm -hmm. You know. All right. Good stuff, though. Try it out. Pretty good. Nice. My work here is done. Okay. <laughs>